and now from the war front a young american soldier destroyed the bunker of terrorists in iraq as the reports came in he is reported to have phone. killed all the terrorists and their leader but there has been no contact by authorities Pick with him up after the phone. that it is still not confirmed whether he's safe or has been captured by this terror group from iraq the whole world is concerned about this young Pick man Pick up the phone Americans are not only worried about him many of them are praying separately for his safe return our correspondent is also waiting for more updates about this brave young son of America It could be anyone Knowing the danger, facing the danger, and still walking into the danger is what a warrior does. You should be proud that you gave birth to a warrior. Anger, hatred. These are the poisons that the war drinks every day. And then you expect our soldiers not to be affected by this, either 6 feet under in the grave or die slowly? Death is not a disaster, but dying for no reason is a disaster. Why? Why war? Wife loses husband, mother loses child. Without killing you can't win a war? Why is it always the woman that feels the responsibility of the suffering in the war? Responsibility means being able to respond to whatever the situation demands. I know it's my Johnny. I think it is. My I think Johnny. so too. It is. so handsome let's take a selfie I hope you can bring home medals like grandpa did and your dad Johnny bye grandpa he's leaving us my Johnny hello hi Johnny Bob. it's Johnny how are you <laughs> forget about me how are you No, let me talk to my brave hero. Let me talk first. How is Grandpa, Bob? <laughs> he's always complaining, but he's fine. D, find out where I should go to pick him up. I'm coming home, but I have a friend with me, okay? Oh no, no friends. No, no, no. No, just we just want to see you. Let him come first. He doesn't have anyone in his life. He has a post-traumatic brain injury, depression, anxiety, memory problems. Let him come. Let him come first. No, no, Johnny, just you. Just you. We want to see just you. We miss you so much, Johnny. He'll only live with me. He was with me every step of the way in country. Don't have an argument with him. He's coming home to us. Think about that. Johnny, just you, please. If he's not allowed to come. Then I won't come home. 
Problem, problem, problem. He's under threat. A terrorist could get him at any time. He needs our support. Well, Grandpa said, okay, I guess it's... All right, we're coming to get you. Where are both of you? It's not my Johnny. No. No. You must be Johnny's friend. I survived the war, but, but at home, my ex existence is nothing. Even you, Mom, you're ready to accept me. In, in, in country, I learned detachment, dignity. Those skills? Only a mother understands the bond between a mother and a child. Nine months I carried you, and forever in my heart. Unfortunately, I get to find out how painful it is when my own flesh and blood deserts me. It was worth the pain and the tears fighting in the war compared to your prejudices. Moreover, your judgmental behavior towards me. The truth is, no one, no one said thank you. After coming home from the war, I didn't bring home medals like Dad, like Grandpa. No, but instead I come home with a broken body, a post-traumatic brain injury, and a suicidal tendency. I understand your suffering. I understand the pain inside you. Remember my pain, the war widow in life, son. You're only responsible for the effort. You're not responsible for the result. Right now, I don't want to listen to anything from your Bible. steps on the risky path to healing. How naive you are. Tell me, who will pay the price for your freedom? For your protection? What is war? What is the intention of war? 
Is the intention of war is to rule the world with power? Who will pay the price for this great nation? This nation didn't become great without massive bloodshed. If he doesn't pay the price of blood for this nation, who will? War demands blood. Winning is everything. Even my son wants to win so badly. The price of coming home with a broken body, a broken mind. And you know what it is? Both sides want to win. In spite of humanity. In spite of who's right or wrong. Innocent or guilty. You know what's boggling my mind? Why? Why war? How did this bloody war come into my own 